You're watching Wisconsin Women. We're filming inside the beautiful interior of Ruth's Chris Steakhouse. That's in Middleton. As you can tell in their name, steak is their specialty. I've been in recently for a, yet another fabulous dinner and fabulous service too. Our next guest has a specialty as well, and that would be spirits. Joining us right now is Abby Abramovich. She and her husband Nick are the owners of Doundrens Distilling, and that's in Cottage Grove. Nice to see you again. Yeah, thanks for having me. Thanks for coming yes. in. You and Nick have really a neat story of how your business started, fell in love, they're both chemical engineers, <laughs> and, um, and now look at you. I think I read on your website you're selling product in over 650 yep. locations. Yep. Oh my gosh. In that's the state amazing. of Wisconsin, yep. And in some in Illinois yep. too. Yep. Oh, my goodness, you guys have been doing <laughs> fantastic. Tell yeah. our viewers about Downdrins. Sure. So Downdrins is an old English term that means afternoon drinking. Um, so we felt like that was a really fun fitting name. <laughs> we have our tasting room and we do all of our distillation and production at our facility in Cottage Grove. Um, we're open year round. We have an indoor tasting room area and then we also have an 11,000 square foot outdoor cocktail garden that we do tons of different events at. Um, we make a huge variety of products so there's something for everybody. And I think it's um, worth mentioning that you do your very best to support the local producers. Yes, mm -hmm. absolutely. So um, we, it's always been a goal of our business from the initial creation to work with and support local producers as much as possible. So um, we source things, uh, a lot of our products are sourced even just in Dane County. So we make a pumpkin brandy that the pumpkins are from a farmer in Cottage Grove. Um, we buy peppers from five to eight different farmers in Dane County. Um, we get our honey out of a small business in Mount Horeb. Um, so it's been really rewarding to actually be able to execute on what we were hoping to do and partner with some other small businesses yeah. and producers. That's awesome that you help all these other small businesses yeah. for your small business, which isn't so small <laughs> right now anymore, yeah. right? <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh. And tell us about like the events and that that you have at your location. Sure. So we're really excited going into this season. We're going to be offering a much bigger variety of events than we have before. Um, so some of those things include like we do a monthly plant sale. I'm bringing out Wisconsin pro wrestling. We're starting a oh bike night. Um, we do drag bingo. We have trivia. Um, there's something for everybody. And then what's really cool um, as well, we have family friendly events. Mm -hmm. We have a playground in our cocktail garden. Um, and then we're launching um, a couple new big kind of festivals, one of them being our Bloody Mary Fest coming up March 26th. Oh my gosh. Let's Jenna, talk. We might have to go to that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about that a little. Um, so the, it's your first annual. Yep. And it's March 26th, which is a Saturday. And I saw that it runs 11 to 2. Yep. How do folks get tickets and tell us what it's going to be like? Sure. So I'm really excited. We're going to have. Um, we're shooting for around 20 different like bars and restaurants, again, supporting those other small businesses. Um, they're going to come out, make their kind of signature Bloody Mary with one of or, you know, some combination of our products. And then anybody who buys a ticket, so it's, it's basically you just get a little tasting glass okay. and you get to go around and sample the Bloody Marys from all of these different bars, restaurants, these vendors. Um, and then vote on who your favorite is, and then they get um, a big, the winner's gonna get a championship belt. It's, there's <laughs> oh gonna be gosh. live music. There's gonna be um, a DJ kind of uh, emceeing the event. Okay. There's gonna be different food trucks there, um, including like supporting Little John's. They're gonna be out kind of oh, fundraising, nice. doing food. Um, so just kind of a big partnership event, and then you get to taste a bunch of different Bloody Marys, it's going to be a really fun time. Oh my gosh. And tickets are on your website. Yes. So that's awesome as well. Nice yep. and easy. Yeah, definitely. And, and again, helping support the other small businesses. Yeah, in the absolutely. Area. That's wonderful. Um, by chance, is your facility like dog friendly? Yes, okay. we're dog friendly year round, both inside and outside. Oh my gosh. Love yep. that. Yep. That's awesome. Pet oh friendly, family friendly. We have um, special, we have certain dog events too, where we like do oh kind of gosh. a pints for pups sort of thing, where we work with a local, um, we work with um, some local adoption, pet adoption oh, nice. rescue agencies. Um, so we do dog adoption events as well. So very pet friendly. 
um, year round. Perfect. So before we head out, um, let's talk about your location. So I mentioned earlier you're in Cottage Grove. Do you really have 11,000 square <laughs> feet? Wow. Yeah. So that's just our outdoor cocktail garden. So we have our indoor <laughs> tasting room. We have our indoor tasting room that's much smaller. Um, but so we are open year round. But then once it's nicer out, we'll go outside. We have um, we lovingly call it the cocktail garden because it is a huge garden yeah. space. I mean, it's a ton of grassy areas. There's over 2,000 square feet of garden beds. And isn't um, there a wow. bike path? Yeah. Right? There's bike paths. Mm -hmm. Yep, some major okay. bike paths uh, that connect like all parts of Wisconsin meet yeah. like within a half a mile of us. Yep. All right, That's we've got wonderful. to run to break. <laughs> Abby, it was so nice to meet you. So check out Downdrin's Distilling. Remember, the Bloody Mary event is March 26th, and that's a Saturday. We'll be right back.